In part A of lab 19, we're going to use red cabbage juice as an indicator for pH. So as it turns out, red cabbage juice, when it's placed in solutions at different pHs, will turn different colors, and that's what you'll see in this lab. And what you want to do there is to record the color of the um, solution as you watch the video here. And again, you can pause the video and then write down your answers. Here are the buffer solutions, very simple solutions. They're different salt mixtures of molecules that have a tendency to maintain a particular pH, pH of one, pH of three, etc. So we don't have the complete set here, it's just the odd number one. So just omit the even number ones. Now the red cabbage juice is just that. It's taken, I've taken red cabbage and chopped it up boiled it in water for a little while, and you have the juice now. And what you can see here is, all right, as I'm adding it to these different buffered solutions, you're getting different colors. And this is going to be used as a, a reference for the pHs of a bunch of different solutions in this lab. And so what you want to do is... Um, reference back to this image. I'm going to post an image of this on Moodle uh, so that you can record your pHs of your of the solutions in part B and part C. Also in those other videos I have in places posted this image of the um, reference solutions um, for you to use. And that's it. Thanks.